prep zone. Oh my goodness! Price splash down. Welcome to the Prep Zone and welcome to the girls volleyball season. My name is Grant Yenny. We're kicking it off with a good one as Slidell travels to take on the Fountain Blue Lady Bulldogs. For the Lady Bulldogs and Coach Casey Mule, they never really rebuild. They just reload six seniors on this squad who all have significant playing time. On the other side of the court, you have the Slidell Lady Tigers led by first year coach Danny Tullis, who Coincidentally, the last time he coached in the St. Timothy Parish Public School System, it was here at Fountain Blue where he won a state championship. Should be a good one tonight. I spoke with both coaches moments ago. Let's hear what they had to say, and we'll get to the action. Coach, it's the first game of the season. How excited are you to get out there and uh, play varsity action? I'm, I'm ready. I mean, the girls are ready. We've been working all summer really hard, and you know this is what they've been practicing for this whole summer, so I'm excited. Coach, it's your first game as the uh, head coach of the Slide L Tigers. What are you looking forward to here tonight? Uh, see if we can control the ball a little bit. You know, we did well in the Jamboree the other day, and we've done well at camps. But I told the girls, all that stuff doesn't count until the score starts flipping. You know, so we got to see if the girls can find a little bit of confidence, a little bit of energy, like what the JV just did. You know, no confidence whatsoever, like scared to death. So things you can normally do, you know, you're trying to change the mindset. So you just assume you're supposed to lose, and you lose. Right, so trying to make them understand just because certain things have happened to you in the past doesn't mean that's what's supposed to happen again. You got volleyball skill, you got intellect. If we can put them together with some consistency, we got something. The Fountain Blue's a tough team, so it's gonna be a tough match for sure. So Slidell serving first here in the kennel to get the 2023 volleyball season underway. Slidell serving it over to Fountain Blue. This one tipped over. Back over to the Fountain Blue side. Set, that's gonna be a double. And Fountain Blue is on the board. Leading 1-0. This brings up Turner Bergeron, a senior for Coach Mule, one of those six seniors that we talked about. Set a big hit there, and that one goes sailing out of bounds. Too much behind it. 2-0. Fountain Blue leading with Bergeron back up to serve. Swatted a little off balance. Here's Alfonso, a lot of forward spin on that one. Great job for the dig there by Kingston. And Slidell is on the board. Fountain blew up, 2-1. This brings up Ava Barduka to serve for the Lady Tigers. This is, uh, like I said, the first match of the season. Though it looks like there's gonna be a sub here. So Barduka comes out, in goes Callie Ezel to serve. For the first match of the season, both teams, zero and zero. Service over from Ezell. Now Alfonso with the free ball. Tipped, diving for it, great effort. Alfonso keeps it up and pushed over to the floor. Excellent diving effort by the libero, Gabby Plaisance. To keep that one in play, then Alfonso popped it up. Lady Bulldogs send it over. And there, catching them off guard. Excellent job by Ava Labatt. Fountain Blue expecting the set. Instead, she tips it over. 3-2. Lady Bulldogs up here in the first. And Labatt serving. There at the last second, uh, Kasnave putting her hands up almost like in self-defense. 
as that one's coming to order, but unable to get under the ball, so it goes to the floor, and it's tied up 3-3 here in the first. This one at the net, tipped back. Excellent job there by Hannah Ellis. Tipping it to the back side, it was undefended, left open. And that one hits the floor, gives the Lady Bulldogs the lead 4-3. And brings up Ellis to serve. Oh, put a lot on that one, sent it like a rocket. Almost over there. Uh, to our buddy Joe Holm. So Reagan Robinson serving. And that one's out, just out past that uh, sideline in front of the Slidell bench, and Slidell has taken the lead 5-4. Robinson with a good serve there. Ellis sets it. Oh, and that looked to be going out, but touched by Kingston. Gives Fountain Blue the point, tying it up 5-5. Big hit there from Addison Nunez. And this brings up senior Ali Alfonso. Back set, kept up by Alfonso to Ellis. Slapped over, and the kill. Turner Bergeron. 6-5, Lady Bulldogs. As Alfonso continues to serve. Big hit there, blocked but kept in play by the Lady Tigers. Nunez tips it over and to the floor, beating the block attempt. Lewis and Rachel. 7-5 Lady Bulldogs as Alfonso continues to serve. Oh, diving effort there from Ellis. We couldn't pop it up, up enough to get to uh, Bergeron. 7-6, Fountain Blue. And this brings up Justice Kingston to serve. And that's an ace for Kingston. And it's tied up, 7-7. Seven, seven. So Kingston going for the lead here. Ellis with the set. That one hits the tape. Good focus by Slidell, keeping it in play. Tip back, and that's a campfire ball. Tipped back by Ava Barduka. And it falls right in the middle with a group of Lady Bulldogs standing around it. Big hit there, and the kill from Bergeron. Kill Bergeron. So tied up at eight here in the first. Coach Tullis down there saying, you need to put your hands out forward, not straight up. When it's straight up, it gives the opportunity for the uh, ball to bank off and go rogue like it did way too much on that serve. And Slido reclaims the lead with the service error. Kaylee McGovern serving here for the Lady Tigers. Ellis back set, too much on it from Nunez. And when she makes contact, it's an absolute rocket, but she needs to work on hitting the ball down to the court. A little too much loft. That's an ace.
So the Lady Tigers are up 11 to eight here in the first. Ellis with a big hit there and the kill for Carmen Pelto, another one of those seniors for Coach Mule. Service over, Kingston dives for it, keeps it up. Oh, and just late on the swing, that one goes into the net. So Whitney Reed serving here for the Lady Bulldogs. And they're gonna call uh, Slidell in the net. So 11 to 11 here in the first. Tipped. This one needs to go over, there it goes. And too much on it. So Fountain Blue reclaims the lead 12 to 11. Big swing there in the dig from Blazons. And that one goes into the net. So now 12-12. Team's trading points here in the first. Service over from Lewis. Tipped over. Not enough back support there as it gets over uh, Bergeron and Pelto there. Back support wasn't there, ball hits the floor. Slido reclaims the lead 13 to 12. Here's Alfonso with a rocket and the dig from Lewis. Oh, and that one off balance goes into the net. This brings up Turner Bergeron. And that's an ace right there at the back line. So it brings up Bergeron once again. Here's Alfonso, tips it over. Robinson sends it right back. Now tipped over by Fountain Blue and kept up. Big hit from Alfonso's block. Swing in for it. Ellis to Alfonso. Here's Robinson. Dig from Reed. And that one goes long. My goodness, 15-13, Lady Bulldogs. So the senior Bergeron still serving. Plaisance pops it up, here's Ellis looking for Alfonso. And great job there by McGovern being prepared. Al Alfonso beat the block, but great back support from McGovern. Tipped over. Here's Alfonso again with the kill. And Coach Tullis takes a timeout as Fountain Blue leads 16-13 here in the first. Bergeron continuing to serve, coming out of the timeout. 
is set over to Robinson. Has to reach back, but sends it over. Ellis looking for Alfonso, and Alfonso with the kill once again. Kill Alfonso. Bergeron with the serve. Set. And they're going to call Fountain Blue in the net. So that makes it 17-14. Lady Bulldogs brings up Ezel to serve. And that's... Wait, we have disputing... Uh, well, they're going to go with the out call. But uh, one of the line judges was saying it was in. Seventeen fifteen. He's L serving once again. This one goes up, off, and banks off the roof. Trajectory got all messed up, and Fountain Blue wasn't ready for it when it came down. So Slidell trying to make a comeback here. This will tie it up. Ellis to Alfonso. Robinson. Slaps it over. Ellis to Alfonso once again, and that is a kill. 18-16. Kill Alfonso. So that brings up Carmen Pelto. Robinson with the kill. kill and that brings up Ava Labat to serve. Back set from Ellis. And a kill for Pelto. Excuse me, for uh, Lange. Served there for, from Ellis. Nobody there. Open area. Addie, uh, Addie Dowell with the kill. This brings up Robinson to serve. And that's an ace for Robinson, tying it up at 19 apiece here in the first. Ellis, a short set there. I think maybe was trying to get it to Lange. Because Nunez was to the far side over here. But uh, it's 20 to 19. We have a timeout on the floor. Sly Slidell leading here in the first. Robinson serving, coming out of the timeout. This one up to the roof, hit over, and to the floor by Addison Nunez. And it's tied up 20-20. Bergeron checks back in as Kaznave comes out. Ellis with the set. Here's Alfonso from the back row. And that's out in front of the Slidell bench, uh, excuse me, Fountain Blue bench area. Oh, did they say? They said it was touched by Fountain Blue. So 21-20, Slidell with the lead. Yeah. 
That's an ace for the Lady Tigers. Alfonso keeps it up and a big hit in the kill for Marley Lange. 22-21, Slidell leading. And this brings up the junior libero, Gabby Plaisance, to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And blocked back. Robinson. Here's Ellis. Hit over by Bergeron. A tip, but Ellis is ready for it. And Alfonso from the back row. Ellis. And the kill for Pelto. 22-22 here in the first. Service over. Here's Ellis. Blocked back. The block there by Barduka and Dowell. Give Slido the lead, 23-22 here in the first. Brings up Kaylee McGovern to serve for the Lady Tigers. Ellis Pelto to the floor. 23-23. Reed with the serve. Tipped over. Plays on diving forward. Ellis looking to catch him off guard. Kingston was ready for it. Back set from Ellis, and that is blocked out of bounds. So it is set point here in the first. Fountain Blue up 24-23. Timeout on the floor. Set point here in the first. Service from Reed. And that is out. So Fountain Blue takes set one, 25-23. So Bergeron will serve to kick off set two. Robinson with the hit. And here's Alfonso. A lot of forward spin on that one. But uh, Slido handles it cleanly. Too much power behind that when it goes out, and Fountain Blue is on the board first here in the second set. Fountain Blue took set one, 25-23. Bergeron with the serve there. And Robinson with a rocket to the back line. And it's tied up one apiece. Slide down. So Callie Ezell in the serve for the Lady Tigers. Back set and beating the block there is Carmen Pelto. Kill Pelto. Rachelle and Robinson jumped up to try and block that one, but Pelto put enough speed behind it. And with uh, Robinson and Rachelle's arms straight up, the ball was able to go through. Too much behind that one. Service error. Ties it up to a piece. Abel Labat to serve. 
Oh, and last second uh, hitting that one. So free ball over. Labat tipped over, back support not in position. Uh, Kayla Rochelle able to tip that one over, and Slidell has the lead 3-2 here in the second. And that's an ace for Labatt. Ace Slidell. Four two, slide L up as Labot continues to serve. Here's Ellis, Alfonso tipping it over. Labot, excellent effort. Ellis pushes it. Alfonso slaps it over. The slide out ready for it. Now Labot, and that'll be a double. Furman checks in as uh, Reed checks out. Here's Ellis to serve. Robinson hits it over, nobody home. In the middle of the court. Plays on to Doe for it there, but was uh, a second behind. And Slidell leads 5-3 here in the second. Ellis. Pelto sends that one. Robinson ready for it. And Alfonso with the kill. Kill Alfonso. So this brings up uh, Alfonso to serve. And that's an ace for Alfonso, and it's tied up five apiece here in the second. Service over. Labat. That one blocked back. And Robinson with the kill. Robinson packs a punch when she makes contact with the ball. And they're giving Slidell the 6-5 lead here in the second. And that one goes into the net. 7-5, Slido leading. Brings up Justice Kingston to serve. Bergeron slaps it over. Slido leading 7-6. Fountain Blue could tie it up here as Plaisance checks in to serve. Robinson sends it over. And that one goes into the net. 8-6, slide out leading. Kaylee McGovern back to serve for the Lady Tigers. And the kill for Ava Furman. Kill Furman. Brings in Reed to serve. As Fountain Blues within one. Labatt with the set. 
And a free ball here from Plaisance. Good eye there from Reed and Alfonso letting that one go. And it's tied up 8-8 here in the second. Labatt diving for it at the net. And a point for the Lady Bulldogs, and they reclaim the lead. 9-8 here in the second. Free ball from Plaisance. Kicked back, swatted back by Turner. Uh, Robinson was ready for it. And point for the Lady Bulldogs. Coach Tullis will take a timeout as Fountain Blue leads 10-8 here in the second. So Reed serving coming out of the timeout. Labatt tips it over. Excellent job with the tip drill there. Plays on to Alfonso. That one blocked back by Pelto and Bergeron. 11-8, Lady Bulldogs leading. So Whitney Reed continuing to serve. And too much on that one, the service error. It's at 11-9. It's early. Game uh, match one of the season. Plaisance pops it up. Bergeron tips it over. Robinson. Here's Pelto. Out. Just across that far sideline. Makes it 11 10. Back set, tipped over by Turner. Into the floor. Tied up, 11 apiece here in the second. And that is an ace for uh, Damani Lewis. So 12-11, Slidell leading. Here's Bergeron. Pelto. Sent over by Bergeron. And it's tied up 12 apiece. They're just changing up the pace. Kind of bumping the ball over with that forward spin. Slidell wasn't ready for it. Now Bergeron will serve. That goes out. Great eye. Great eye there by McGovern letting that one go. Slide out reclaiming the lead 13-12. So Ezell back in to serve. Ellis to Alfonso and the kill. Uh, Labatt. Kill. And Rachel jumped up to try and block it there. But uh, the way Alfonso hit it, it went into their arms and just fell straight to the floor on the uh, slide L side. Good diving effort there to keep it in play. And Alfonso tips it over. Back support, out of position there, not behind the front line. Wide open gap there. Alfonso tips it to the floor. And a kill 
for Robinson. Fourteen, fourteen. Ava Labatt back to serve. Ellis. And tipped down by Addie Dowell. Slido reclaims the lead here in the second, 15-14. Now it goes into the net. Caught it on the descent there. Hit too far on top. Ball goes into the net. Want to catch it at the highest point. 16-14. Slido leading here in the second. With Labatt serving. And that's an ace for Labatt. Ace. Slido. That makes it 17-14 for the Lady Tigers. And we have a timeout on the floor here in the second. Labatt with the serve here coming out of the timeout. Ellis to Alfonso to the floor. And that'll bring up Hannah Ellis to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And too much on it from Ellis. 18-15. Robinson with the serve and there. Hands up in, in self-defense like we saw in the first set, but uh, you're not getting under it to control it. In that case, the ball hits the palm and falls to the floor. Back set from Ellis, a long back set to Alfonso, and that's a kill right there in front of Coach Tullis. Nineteen sixteen, slide out as Fountain Blue looks to battle back. Ellis with the dig and putting the roof on it is Damani Lewis. Twenty to sixteen, Lady Tigers lead. Brings up Kingston. Ellis. This one at the net and falls. So the big hit there went to Robinson. Couldn't handle it cleanly. And it kind of went rogue into the net. Falls to the floor. 20 to 17. Lady Tigers leading. Plaisance with the serve. Labatt. And a tip. Dig there from Lewis. And a point for the Lady Tigers. Makes it McGovern. Too much on that one. Hits the slide out bench. 22 17. <clears throat> and now too much on it from the slide out side. Fountain Blue is still trailing by four here in the second. Let's 
brings up Whitney Reed to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. Labatt, dig there from Reed, and Bergeron couldn't get it over. That's four touches. 23-18, Lady Tigers. Coach Mule is going to call a timeout here in the second. Coming out of the timeout, it's Lewis serving for the Lady Tigers. Big hit there from Pelto, and that's a kill. 23-19. Labatt blocked back. Robinson sends it over. Ellis Talfonso with the kill. So Bergeron serving. That one, oh my goodness. Falling in between Plaisance and Bergeron, and it is set point here in the second. And that one goes long. Set point two with the Lady Bulldogs serving. And Carmen Pelto will serve. Good serve from Pelto. Here's Labatt for Robinson, and a rocket to the floor at the back line, and Slidell takes set two, 25-21. Top of set three, Damani Lewis to serve. Tied up. One apiece in sets. Bergeron hits it over. And a rocket to the floor. My goodness. Raven Robinson. On, they're going to call. They're going to call Slidell in the net. Points. So the point goes to the Lady Bulldogs. And they're on the board first, 1-0. Here's Robinson. Alfonso with the tip over. And that one tipped over and to the floor. Wide open area there in the middle of the court. 1-1 here in the third. And Casnave checks in. Bergeron comes out. Alfonso hits it over. And the kill for Robinson. 2-1, slide L up. Ellis tried to tip that one over to try and catch Slidell off guard. Instead, the ball goes into the net. And uh, quickly here in the third, Slidell's up to a 3-1 lead. Alfonso sends that one, Robinson. Ellis back to Alfonso, caught it on the descent. He goes into the net. 4-1, Lady Tigers. Yeah. 
And that's an ace for Ezell. Ace. Slidell. 5 1. Slidell up here in the third. And Pelto with the kill. And that'll bring Pelto back to serve. Labatt, Robinson. Here's Alfonso tipped over there. Slapped back. My goodness, the quick reflexes of the Lady Tigers. Slidell up 6-2 here in the third. Here's Labatt serving again. And that's a kill for Kayla Rachel. Rachel, a 4.0 student since she's been in high school. Seven two. Here's Robinson. That's out. Just past the back line. So, whoa, 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 whoa. Was that called in? We have a timeout on the floor. That looked out to me. Anyway, 8-2 slide L here in the third. Labatt with the serve. And that one goes into the net. So to clarify that point before the timeout, it was a touch called uh, on the Lady Bulldogs. I, I, I didn't, I guess I missed that, but the ball definitely hit past that back line. 8-3. Blocked back, and to the floor there, Alfonso and Lange. So Fountain Blue looking to battle back here, trailing by four here in the third. Back set, there's Robinson. And the kill for Addy Dowell. And they're going to call Slidell in the net. So Fountain Blue back to trailing by four. This brings up Ali Alfonso to serve. And that one blocked back by Dowell and Rachel. Slidell up 10-5 here in the third. Kingston with the serve. Tipped over. 
Beats the front line there. Ball falls to the floor. Jill Wayne. Plaisance with the serve. Oh, kept up by Plaisance. Great play there and free ball over from Ellis. Labatt back set, and Dowell sends that one long. 10-7. Lady Tigers lead. Service from Plaisance. Into the net. Plaisance continues to serve. And that one goes long. So McGovern back to serve. Bergeron hits it over. And that one goes long. Lady Bulldogs within two. And this brings up Whitney Reed to serve. And the kill for Barduka. So Damani Lewis back to serve. Bergeron. This one's over. Ellis slaps it over. And Slidell was ready for it, and that's going to be in the net. Uh, Pelto. Point Slidell. 13 9, Lady Tigers up. Bergeron with the kill. Whoa, no call there. And that is a kill for Robinson at the back line. So 14-10, Lady Tigers up here in the third. And that's outside the antenna. Coach Mule is going to take a timeout as Slidell leads 15 to 10 here in the third. Coming out of the timeout, Ezel serving for the Lady Tigers. Tip over from Pelto. And I think, are they going to call a double? A double called. So 15 11. And this brings up Carmen Pelto to serve once again for the Lady Bulldogs. A 
and Robinson hits it into the block. And uh, as Coach Tullis was coaching on his side of the court earlier, their arms were straight up in the air rather than up and uh, out. And uh, so when the ball hit their arm, it falls to the floor. Free ball from Robinson. Ellis, oh, and too much on it. Seventeen eleven. Lady Tigers leading here in the third. And free ball over from Reed. And they're going to call Fountain Blue in the net. So 18-11, Lady Tigers leading. Free ball over. Balls to the floor there, 20-11. And that's an ace. Slido. So Labat continuing to serve. And dumped down by Rachel. Makes it 21-11. This one up to the basketball goal. Ellis trying to catch him off guard. Robinson was ready for it. Robinson ready for it again. Here's Labatt back to Robinson. And the kill right in that far corner. Makes it 22-11 here in the third. Robinson. Labat. Now here's Alfonso with the hit. Alfonso with the big hit and the kill. Splitting defenders there. And Lewis and uh, Kingston. And Alfonso sent it right in the middle of them. 22 to 12. Alfonso, what a forward spin there, sends it over. Alfonso. Out of reach of uh, Lewis and Robinson there. Still a pretty big gap in the score here. Slide up 22-13 here in the third. And that one goes long. Coach Tullis is going to take a timeout. Slide up, 22-14 here in the third. Slide
Coming out of the timeout, Ellis serving for the Lady Bulldogs. Ellis to Alfonso, to the floor. 22-15, Lady Tigers. Ellis serving here. Labatt, Robinson up to the ceiling, and that's out. It's over the crowd there. So 23-15. Okay, so they were doing a lineup check on the court, making sure the right person was serving and the right people were coming out. And Robinson sends that one over. Here's Ellis to Alfonso, diving effort from Robinson to keep it in play. And that's out. But they're saying Fountain Blue touched it. Fountain Blue doesn't know when. They were protesting a little bit there, but play on. Back over to Slidell, and I think it's supposed to be 24-15. There it is, okay, so this is set point here in the third. Back set, Alfonso, and it's blocked back. And Slidell takes set three. 25-15. Top of the fourth here at the kennel. Fountain Blue serving and Slidell goes on the board first. So the mission is pretty clear here. Slidell it takes, either takes this first set and wins this one in four, or Fountain Blue wins it and can force a fifth set and keep going here in this match. Both teams have to keep their foot on the pedal here in this fourth set. Alfonso hits it over. And Slidell goes up 2-0 here in the fourth. And a kill there for Robinson. Kill Slidell. Ezel with the serve, and that is, well, it was played off of the uh, basketball goal. Robinson tips it over. Alfonso sends it over with the free ball. And the kill for Kayla Rachel. And Slidell is up 4-0 here in the fourth. And catching them off guard there is Pelto. Putting the Lady Bulldogs on the board. Kill. 
And that brings up Pelto to serve. And here's Robinson. And that was slapped over by the Lady Bulldogs by Lange. And yep, they're gonna call Slidell in the net. The, uh, the set there was way too close to the net. So Robinson was doing her best to try not to uh, cross that line. But in order to even attempt to make a play there, she had to get close. And that one back over to the slide L side and putting the roof on it, slamming it down. It's Marley Lange. And uh, they're going to say uh, she was in the net. Five two slide L leading here in the fourth. Labat put the roof on it there was uh, Lange and Alfonso. Alfonso hits it over Kingston with the dig. And that's outside the antenna. This brings up Hannah Ellis to serve. Way too much on it. 6-3, Lady Tigers. And way too much on that one. Service error and then service error. So this brings up Ali Alfonso to serve. And dumped to the floor by Thurman. So 6-5, Tigers leading. Fountain Blue looking to tie it up right here. The back set, Dowell. Oh, Thurman tried to power it over and uh, just caught it on the descent and sent it into the net. 7-5, Tigers leading. This will bring up uh, the libero, Justice Kingston. And that's a kill for Lange. Coach Tullis saying uh, it was 100% out. I, I didn't see that. The play is under review. So now they're going to talk it over. I'm interested to see this replay when we look at it back. It looked into me. They're having a discussion over there on the far side. And they're gonna say a redo. The point is being replayed. So Kingston will serve. And sends that one out. Seven, six, Fountain Blue looking to tie it up here with the junior libero, Gabby Plazon serving. And 
And that one goes into the net. It's tied up 7-7 here in the fourth. The line judge is saying that it was in. Slidell is all saying that it was out. The point awarded to Fountain Blue. So Robinson will go over and talk it over to the judges' stand. So 8-7 Fountain Blue here in the fourth. Fountain Blue's taking the lead. And a point for Slidell. Tied up once again as that one ricocheted off the block attempt of the Lady Bulldogs. And Kaylee McGovern back to serve. And that is an ace for McGovern. And Slidell has reclaimed the lead 9-8. Slidell. And that one sent long. 10-8, Lady uh, Tigers. <laughs> Ellis. And a kill for Carmen Pelto. <clears throat> kill. Oh. Whitney Reed serving. And Ellis catching him off guard. 10-10. Kill Ellis. So Reed with the serve. The big hit there in the kill for Damani Lewis. Kill Slidell. So Slidell now leads 11-10. Pelto. And a point for the Lady Bulldogs. Pelto tipped that one over, a diving effort there from McGovern, but not in time. And it's 11 to 11 here in the fourth. Big hit there. Ellis. Over to Alfonso, tipping it over. And the third hit gets it over. Ellis with the back set. And the point for the Lady Bulldogs. And the Lady Bulldogs have reclaimed the lead 12-11. Robinson. Met at the net, Alfonso sends it over. Tipped, and to the floor. Uh, 
Ava Barnuka. So tied up, 12 apiece here in the fourth. Here's Alfonso with the point. Ricocheting off of slide L. Fountain Blue leading 13 to 12 here in the fourth. It brings up Pelto to serve. A rocket sent over and Fountain Blue ready for it. Here's Alfonso slapping it over. This one needs to get over. Robinson gets it there, my goodness. Robinson with the tip and to the floor. And it's tied up 13-13 here in the fourth. Labat to serve. And a free ball. And Robinson, oh, the pick! Oh, back over and out of bounds. My goodness. Slide out leading, 14-13 here in the fourth. Here's Alfonso with the kill. And it's tied up 14-14. Well, Hannah Ellis serving for the Lady Bulldogs. Sends that one long. And Slidell takes the lead once again, 15-14. And that's an ace. Wow. To the corner ace for Robinson. Robinson serving once again as her team leads 16-14. Tip back. And putting the roof on it is Lange. Kill Lange. 16-15. Lady Tigers lead, Alfonso looking to tie it up here for the Lady Bulldogs. Ellis pushes it, and that is in right at the back line for Turner Bergeron. Tied up 16 apiece here in the fourth. What a match this has been. Alfonso with the serve. And tipped over out of reach by Rachelle. And it brings up the libero Justice Kingston to serve. And a spot on the floor to wipe up. Quickly handled. So Kingston serving with slide L up, 
<clears throat> Tipped over, Alfonso ready for it. Labatt back set, and the kill for Addie Dowell. So a timeout called on the floor. Slido leading 18-16 here in the fourth. Coming out of the timeout, Slido up 18-16 with Kingston continuing to serve. And a free ball over. Diving effort there by Robinson. And Alfonso sends it. Ellis to the floor. Over the front line, rolling over. Point for the Lady Bulldogs. <clears throat> so 18-17. Plays on with the serve. And Fountain Blue has tied it up as Pelto and Bergeron put the roof on it. 18-18 here in the fourth. Plays on with the serve. Punched over by Plays and falls to the floor. Damani Lewis, 19-18, slide out leading. So 19-18. Lady Tigers up. Now here with uh, McGovern serving. Tip back. Plaisance ready for it. Now here's Plaisance with the free ball. Labatt. And that's tipped out of bounds for the point for the Lady Tigers. Makes it 20 to 18. As McGovern continues to serve. Is Alfonso from the back row with the kill? Kind of caught uh, Kingston and Robinson looking. Twenty to nineteen. Reed with the serve. Here's Lewis, and that one hits the Fountain Blue bench area, and we're tied up again. Twenty to twenty. And the kill for uh, Ava Barduka gives Slidell the lead once again. 21-20 here in the fourth. And a kill for, a, uh, for Carmen Pelto. Kill 
21-21 as Bergeron serves it. Here's Alfonso. And a point for the Lady Tigers. 22-21. That brings up Callie Ezell. Excellent diving effort there after uh, Ellis tried to catch Slidell off guard. Here's Alfonso. And a kill for Pelto. 22-22 here in the fourth. Kill, kill Pelto. And that one hitting the tape. Robinson ready for it. Excellent job there by Lange. Block back again. Here's Robinson and sends that one long. No, they say Fountain Bull touched it. So I think they need to reverse the score. Should be 23-22. There it is. So slide up 23-22. And a timeout called 23-22, Slido leading here in the fourth. Coming out of the timeout, Labat serving. Ellis set to Alfonso. Lewis with the dig. And the block from Molly Lange. Ties it up, 23-23 here in the fourth. Ellis with the serve. Tipped over. And beat the front line. Open spot right behind them. And it is match point. Match point for the Lady Tigers. Robinson looking to put it away. A free ball. Labatt. Dow hits it. And it falls to the floor. And Slidell takes the fourth set. 25-23 and takes the match in four sets. What a way to start the season. Let's send our thank yous to those who helped bring you this match, starting with our superintendent, Mr. Frank Jabia, director of broadcasting, Dr. Melody Menard, cameraman, editor, and coordinator of Channel 13, Dave the Rave Williams, from the kennel, where Slidell beats Fountain Blue in four. My name is Grant Yenny. Good night. <laughs>